So have you been wanting to shoot videos but you don't know where to start? So this video is for people who want to shoot videos but just can't get started. So if this is you, then stay tuned because it's coming up. So welcome back. In this video, I'm going to share with you two quick tips. If you're the person who wants to produce content but just don't know where to get started. And these two quick tips is very simple and you probably know this but I'm just going to reiterate this one and maybe, you know, give you some ideas and some tips so that you can get started and you will not get stuck when you are shooting videos, okay? Tip number one is you need to identify what are the things that you love to talk about. This is not just a one-time video. This is for long term. It could be a month. It could be a six months. It could be a year or probably more than a year. So you need to make sure the topic that you wanted to talk about. So just say, for example, for me, I love to talk about, you know, shooting videos. I love to talk about motivating people. I love to talk about inspiring people, making an impact. Those are the things that I want to talk about. So for you, think about the topic that you want to talk about. Is this about real estate? Is this about weather? Is this about travel? Is this about whatever it is okay whether it is weird you need to think about the topic that you want to talk about so that you have a clear message so that people will know if they need this information they will just go right to you so think about the topic and if you can't nail down this topic you will be like shooting a lot of videos a lot of topic without even a targeted topic to talk about so make sure that you are good in one thing okay you make sure that you are good in one thing this is what your job is be good at just one thing and then forget about the other thing because if you're good in one thing then you can branch out to other things that is related to what you're good at so that's tip number one so make sure that you nail the topic that you want to talk about that's it so tip number two is probably one of the most hindrances of people who wants to produce content and this is especially if you are pretty new and you are just getting started because this is holding you back because you will ask yourself like okay what should i talk about about today what are the things that I need to shoot on today so those are some of the objections that most content creators producers are having so you need to think about when you create your videos think about the things that your audience have questions okay what are the, your audience objections why they can't start doing something and that's where you come in. So just say, for example, in videos, I will think about the things or the questions that some people have this belief or some people have these problems why they can't shoot videos. So I need to think about those objections that is stopping them from making videos. So number one, what are the things that they should talk about? Number two, it could be how to face the camera without being shy. Number three is how to become not so weird looking on the camera. And number four, it could be how can I shoot a good quality video? So those are some of the common objections that my audience has. That's why they are being stuck or they have these objections that they can't move forward. They can step one step forward. They can't do the things that they want to do. So think about when you have these common questions and it is so easy to find these questions. You can just look up online. It can be in Google or it can be the answerthepublic.com. That is a good resources which you know all the questions that most people are searching on the internet are there so that you can start from there and think about or find those common questions so that you can answer or you can make videos about those questions because think about it especially if you are producing videos on youtube youtube is a search engine youtube is not a social media so when people are looking for things when people are looking for information they tend to go to google and type how to shoot a video, how to edit a video. And then when they press enter or when they press search, the videos from YouTube will come up and some of the articles from blogs and other websites will also come up because YouTube is a searchable platform. So you need to think about those stuff when you are putting video. Where are you going to put your video? Where are you going to upload your video? It could be YouTube, it could be Facebook, it could be Instagram. Think about those things so that you can really optimize your video because you know where to publish it, you know where to upload it. So those are just the common two 
quick tips for you so that you can start making videos so if you can't get started remember there are two things that you need to remember okay remember a lot of remember right so two things that you need to remember first is you need to nail down or you need to identify what are the topics that you are passionate talking about second try to find these objections try to find these you know questions that your audience or your possible audience has so that you can talk about those questions and those videos that you make will serve as a solution will serve as an answer for those people who are looking for the answer from their questions i know it sounds weird i know it's like ah so anyways just remember those things nail the topic and then number two is answering questions that your audience has okay so i hope you learned from this video and if you do don't forget to like and subscribe or if you're watching this on facebook then come along and i would love for you to get along in this journey and share with you some of my ideas some of my thoughts some of my experience when it comes to creating videos so if you want to make your own videos you want to start producing videos then you know come on okay have a ride and i hope you learned something today and if you do don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and you know simply share this one it is for you to help out other friend or other people so that they can see this information especially if they are looking this information so without further ado i would love to see you tomorrow ciao for now